A common way to create facial animation is to use a face rig that is animated by hand. While this gives you artistic control, it is difficult to create the subtle details of a real person's face, such as the wrinkles and skin dynamics. We present a data-driven technique for adding such fine-scale details and expressiveness to low-resolution art-directed facial animations. Freedom is just chaos with better lighting. Face rigs are just one example of low-resolution facial animations. Another example is the popular motion capture approach, where a sparse set of markers define a low-resolution face animation. Again, subtle details like wrinkles are not captured. A third example is performance capture from an ocular video, where a low-resolution 3D morphable model is dynamically fit to a single video sequence. This approach also fails to capture the fine-scale details of the actor's performance. Another example comes from recent technology by FaceShift, where an actor drives a low-resolution blend-shape model using a Kinect depth sensor. These four approaches can all create facial animations, but all suffer from a lack of fine-scale details. In this paper, we propose a new framework for enhancing such low-resolution art-directed facial animations, targeting the subtle details of deformation that make a real individual's face performance so compelling, but often elude both hand animation and motion capture. Our input is the low-resolution facial animation and a high-resolution performance capture database of the target actor. Here we show a few database frames for two different actors. Note the fine details and wrinkles contained in the database. Our algorithm can enhance both the spatial details as well as the temporal dynamics of the performance by matching the input sequence to the database in shape space and then transferring the missing details to the input animation. Here we show an example where the input expression at the top is not in the database, so our algorithm automatically blends between two different database frames to create a closely matching result. We test the algorithm on a validation example consisting of a high-resolution ground truth sequence, which of course is not part of the database. To mimic a low-resolution input, we smooth the ground truth sequence. The resulting enhancement closely matches the original ground truth. We demonstrate the power of our algorithm by enhancing several different sequences that are generated by common facial animation approaches. First, here is the result of enhancing a facial rig. Our enhanced geometry is shown in the center and rendered with texture on the right. Freedom is just chaos with better lighting. Notice the realistic forehead wrinkles and other identifying characteristics of this actor. Here we show an enhanced motion capture animation. Despite the sparse marker arrangement, the resulting animation captures the fine details of this actress. For comparison, here we see the result next to the real actress. Our third example shows that low-resolution morphable face models can also be enhanced to increase the realism of monocular face capture. So I had this dog named Gilligan. He was my dad's dog, and then my dad got really sick, and so I took him. Finally, we show our enhancement result of a performance-driven rig animation created with face shift technology. Despite the less accurate input data, our method produces realistic actor-specific facial details. Logic will get you from A to B. Imagination will take you everywhere. We compare our spatial enhancement approach to the polynomial displacement map technique of Ma and colleagues, first on the motion capture input sequence. Since polynomials don't extrapolate well, their approach has problems with input that is far away from the training set, causing artifacts on the cheek and forehead. These artifacts are further exaggerated on the connect input, which is even further outside the database. Here we show an example of data-driven temporal enhancement for a smile sequence in slow motion. Linear interpolation of two keyframes, shown in the center, doesn't capture the correct dynamics of this actor. The closest matching database sequence is shown on the left, which of course does contain the correct dynamics, the smile starts fast and ends slowly. On the right we show the enhanced result. Notice that we maintain the user's artistic intent of producing only a half smile, but the dynamics now match the database. We illustrate the result even further by plotting the displacement of a single vertex at the corner of the mouth. 
The temporally enhanced result comes as close as possible to the database dynamics while retaining the spatial constraints of the input sequence. In this paper, we present a technique for adding fine scale details and expressiveness to low resolution facial performances. With our technique, art directed face animations can now be enhanced to match the expressive quality of high resolution performance capture.